when you've experienced so much stuff, especially not all of it positive, going through all the darkness and feeling like you're alone in your journey, it can really have an effect on you and you can wind up staying there if you're not careful. But I remember being the only one in the room that seemed like I had sense. I remember being the only one in the room that felt outcasted as people would talk about things that just seemed dumb. But I'm like, uh, well, okay, this is a conversation that's happening and maybe this is the room that I should be in. So even when I didn't feel comfortable, I stayed because I felt like, well, these are my friends, these are my family, this is people that I should wanna be around, right? Because of all the layers of conditioning and things that we go through over the years, we believe that um, because somebody's in our lives that we have to keep them in our lives. Hold on, something in my eye. <laughs> But that's not necessarily true. Just because somebody's a part of your life, that doesn't mean that they have to stay in your life, right? You get to decide who's in your life. And I remember being afraid to be the light, being the bright shining light in every room that I was in for fear of being judged. I knew I was smarter than a lot of the people that I was in the room with, but that wasn't it. I was afraid that whatever I said, they may not like it as a result, not like me. As a result, I'm no longer invited into those rooms. It wasn't until I said, you know what? I don't give a, uh, I don't care. Regardless of what room I'm invited in, I'm going to be my whole self, my organic self. For those of you guys who know me, I am loud, I am funny, I am creative, I am, I don't give a, uh, that's me, that's who I am. And that's what I bring into every room. And when I started doing that, man, shit changed, like in a big way. Like, I started realizing that I started attracting people who seriously wanted to be around me, and I no longer had it to mute myself. So wherever you're going through, no matter what rooms you guys are in, be that light. Be okay with not going with the grain. Be okay with not continuing to believe what other people are believing. Just be okay being you. Be that light. Because I'm telling you, there's so many people waiting for your light so that they can get the permission to shine. Wish you guys all the best.